according to the notes, it sounds like when you, you know, showed up to set or you knew you were going to be making the movie, you didn't realize how much improv there was possibly going to be while you were making it. What, were you surprised? Like that? I much? was glad. I, you know, that's, I enjoy that as long as I know, I mean, I knew the script, but I actually told Tyler, I came up with a couple of jokes I wanted to do and I brought it to him and he goes, hey, you know, go ahead, do it. That's what, that's what I got you for. You're funny, <laughs> man. You do your deal. And then Kathy and Jimmy, she came up to me and she said, hey, do you think I'll be able to do, I got this thing that I want. I said, hey, I did the same thing. I said, I had a couple of jokes. He told me to go ahead and do it. He said, have fun. <laughs> she goes, oh, this is going to be fun. I said, I know. So I bet we had lived half of our deal. Tyler said actually that there's like an NC-17 version of this movie somewhere. Like, oh, where yeah, you guys were, sure. were, were there things that you were you remember that were like, you know, oh, well, this will never make it into the film, but maybe the gag reel down the road. Man, I can't. There was literally so many. I mean, we filmed this a long time ago, so there were literally <laughs> so many. We had lived in everything. I mean, sometimes I would do a. We would do stuff, and then we would cut, and then I go, man, that was really funny. And then we were going to, of course, do another, but I couldn't remember what we were just had done <laughs> because it was like in the heat of the moment, you know? Yeah. But yeah, there was a lot of ad libbing going on. A lot of, lot, it was really fun, made for a good movie. And did Tyler, you know, uh, did he surprise you at all as a director? Was he, he what you were expecting or, or no? Yeah, I didn't expect him. I didn't know he was going to direct in the Madea outfit. Well, that was my question. Like, how, how, how awkward was, was that? Weird, or was it like you just got used to it quick? You know, you got used to it quick. You know, I see why he did it. He just didn't want to change. You know, because you got to keep getting in that and out of the outfit. So finally, said, "Out oh, the hell with it. I'll just direct in the outfit." So that was kind of that was funny. And can you talk about uh, you're in uh, Kathy's? Um, it's Kathy, right? Mm -hmm. uh, you're in Kathy's uh, relationship. So you're the only one that gets has to wonder if it's Kathy. Everybody else, did, and then Jimmy or the Jimny. But you're well, the see, one. Well, see, I was smart enough like, to not. You're uh, like Richard Lipschitz. You're concerned with the Richard. Yes, I want to get the right part. I want to get the first part right. Uh, you had your own background for these characters. You wanted them to sort of like not be what you you would expect them—that they were like loving and 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 that they really cared for each other. Can you talk about like what you guys talked about before you guys shot the movie? We got together, and Kathy, before we went out there, Kathy came up and said, "Hey, listen, here's what I think we should be. I don't want to be like this scene here has me doing this. I'm not that kind of a wife. I don't think. I think." <laughs> that we kid around and you do jokes to me and I do jokes to you and other people would think, I can't believe he said that to her, but these two people just love each other so much, but they have both have great senses of humor. And, yeah, yeah. and I said, hey, I'm with you. That's how I wanted to play it. So I'm thinking that, that was pretty much it. Then we went and we did it. I mean, so we, I think we both know people like mm. the characters that we were playing in the movie. So it wasn't that hard. For breaking entertainment news and more, follow at HitFix on Twitter or visit HitFix.com.